To the duffers, the hacks. We've been there. To the three and four putters, we learned. And to the rough riders and sandmen, we're ready to teach you. To everybody out there who thinks they can't play the game, the over 28,000 PGA golf professionals say, we're here to help you discover or rediscover the joys of golf. To you and you and you, we're here. The Philadelphia Section PGA is here to teach you. Play golf, Delaware Valley. And there's a, a little muni of Cypress Grove that have, I just think is one of the prettiest little And now it's time for Teed Off, brought to you by Yingling, America's oldest brewery. Welcome back to Inside Golf. It's time for Teed Off. And today we're in Bethlehem at the Cigars International Superstore. And we have a super panel for Teed Off. Mark Wogenrich is the golf writer for the Allentown Morning Call, native here of the Lehigh Valley. Of course, we have Tony Leodora, Golf Styles Magazine, also the host weekly on Saturday mornings of Golf Talk Live on WNTP. And another old favorite of ours, Joe Logan from MyPhillyGolf.com. Joe, the holiday season is coming up. How about Thanksgiving weekend? The weather's going to be maybe good around the Philadelphia area in the Lehigh Valley, but your friend just hit the lottery. Gives you a call and says, Joe, I want to go on a nice golf weekend right around the holidays, and I'm not going to make the call. You're going to make the call. Where are you going? For me, it's an easy call. I've, I've been to a lot of golf destinations. The one place I haven't yet been that I'm dying to go to is Bandon Dunes. You know, you got four courses out there, each one better than the last. And uh, I've done Scottsdale, I've done Pinehurst, I've done Myrtle Beach. And, and for those of us who don't know, give the location. Oh, it's in Oregon. It's, I'm sorry, it's on the right. coast of Oregon. It's like Scotland. Uh, I mean, it's, it's maybe the hottest golf destination going right now. Four marvelous courses. Not a three-hour we'll three trip exactly, Tony. Yeah. Huh? That's on my bucket <laughs> list, there's no question. But if I'm only going for Thanksgiving weekend, three days, I'm going to be spending two days closer. traveling. I, obviously, the first thing that comes to mind is the easy one, Myrtle Beach, one-hour flight out on Spirit Airlines right out, out of Atlantic right. City, an hour and five minutes, boom. You know, it's, it's the great one. However, we are saying that my best friend hit the lottery. <laughs> So I might make him spend a little more money, and I just came back, and it really opened my eyes. An hour and 45-minute flight out of Philadelphia, Bermuda. I was at Tucker's Point. The pink they, sand. Oh, my gosh. What an incredible eye-opener that was. The golf is phenomenal. This Tucker's Point hotel and resort there and spa is to die for. Brand new, just opened. It's on the site of, of one of the old hotels they had there, and they redid it. The golf course redone by Roger Rulowich. And, you know, as I said, an hour and 45 minutes. Bermuda is really very pretty cool. How about you, I Mark? I might be on his connecting <laughs> flight, actually, out to Bandit. But I'm going to go a little south of there to the Monterey Peninsula. I've been there a couple of times uh, to play. I, I did. I plunked down the money. I paid, you know, I think it was the last time I was there. It was 350 Wait a minute. you got to call Pebble Tony. Beach. He'll get you on Cypress, <laughs> but, Pebble. Okay, that, and I was going to say, my friend was going to have to use some of that cash he won on the lottery to, to, to buy an invite to, to Cypress Point. But if Tony's got an in, we'll use that instead. But, I mean, they've got the two renovated courses there with uh, the Monterey Peninsula, uh, the courses, Spyglass I've wanted to play. Um, and there's a, a little muni called Cypress Grove that ab I just think is one of the prettiest little munis. That back nine looks like you're playing in Scotland. Well, you know, Tony, uh, I just happen to have the fortune of being away this coming Thanksgiving weekend. Uh, I do Temple basketball, and the Owls are going to be down at Disney World for a tournament that begins actually Thanksgiving night. I'll be there until Sunday. Now, I have to go to somebody like yourself. I've played all the, most of the Disney courses. It's been a while. Magnolia, The Palm, Osprey Ridge. If I'm down there for maybe three rounds of golf, what's your pecking order? Well, you know, there's, there's some terrific golf courses down there. The, the new course at... Uh, In Lake Buena uh, Vista? Yeah, the old, you know, St. Andrew's replica type thing. Our old friend Steve Schaller from Seaview, the director of golf there, is now the director of golf at Falcons Fire. That's <laughs> Schaller, S... S-H-A-L-E-R, a Reese Jones course right there. Um, Champions Gate ain't bad. Champions Gate is terrific. That's Mr. Uh, Ledbetter's hangout. Yeah, right. two Greg Norman courses right there. And our old friend Ron Garl has a wonderful uh, couple of courses there, w one on the eastern side in DeLand, Victoria Hills, and another one uh, just south of uh, 
uh, Orlando out in the uh, developed area there on the other side of Kissimmee. So a lot of pretty good golf down there. There's no question. Yeah. Leaving up Bay Hill. Well, <laughs> that's right. If the guy's paying the money, you I'll better go over to Bay Hill. Arnold, Arnold. Uh, uh, friend of right? Tony Leodora on the line, Arnold. Yeah. How about that? That will work, won't yeah, it? And while you're down there at Thanksgiving, you can go for the first anniversary of uh, everybody's going to oh, meet boy. outside of Tiger's at Isleworth. Where he, in Isleworth where he crashed the car. It's going to be a big gathering right around that tree there. I think. You don't think there will be? <laughs> you know all the satellite news trucks are going to be out there, right? A year ago today, That's right. at this very location, at this very hour, somebody ran we'll over a fire hydrant. Isleworth that day, too. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't wait for that. I think I'll pass on the Isleworth trip, though. But. Enjoy wherever you're going. You're going down to uh, Bermuda? I think I'm going to Bermuda for you're a You're going to the Monterey and you're going to Oregon. Or, wow. I'll see you on the red eye back. Okay. <laughs> yeah, try to hook up, get some frequent flyers. We'll be back. Inside Golf continues in just a moment. Tee Off has been taped on location at Cigars International Superstore in Bethlehem, PA, the largest retailer of premium cigars in the nation. Check out their website for specials and to place your next order at cigarsinternational.com. I like to think the Yingling Beer Company has established a name for itself after over 180 years. In 1987, we introduced a flavorful amber lager. I hoped it would appeal to a new generation of customers who wanted a quality beer with taste and character. Ask for a lager and you'll get a Yingling. The Yingling name didn't make us a success. Our quality products, our employees, and our customers did. Guests of Inside Golf enjoy dining at Sin Sin, the popular Asian fusion restaurant located on Germantown Avenue in the heart of scenic Chestnut Hill. I don't know about you, but when you look at Tony, you figure golf, dining, the dark and storm and a spa. I want to see Tony in the spa. Uh, I, I don't. I don't want to no? see that now. TMI? <laughs> <laughs> hey, folks, it's that time of the year. Happy Thanksgiving to all our yes, viewers coming absolutely. up next week. Some pumpkin pie. There you go. And, you know, it's still not too late to get out there. I know maybe not as much sunshine, but always uh, football and golf on Thanksgiving. Well, what do we got coming up? We are going south to Myrtle Beach. And Harry, wait until you see some of these courses. We were actually just down there, and coming up, we're going to show you guys that in a couple of weeks, actually. Don't miss it. It's like, what, a dozen courses? Yes. In Myrtle Beach. Colleen does Myrtle Beach. It's something you're not going to want to miss, and it's coming up during the month of January. That'll make us warm up. Hey, that's going to do it. We want to thank Tony for his little travel log, and uh, thank all the folks down in Bermuda for their help as well. For Colleen Wolf, I'm Harry Donahue. Remember, no matter how bad it's going for you, dark and stormy, don't pick up. <laughs> See you next time on Inside Golf. Inside Golf has been brought to you in part by Yingling, America's oldest brewery, and by the Philadelphia Section PGA.